This is the moment of truth. I'm hoping that everything went well. I don't see why it wouldn't. Uh, we did everything exactly the way we should have. We spritzed the uh, side with some um, softener to soften it to make it bend easier. We've lubricated it with some water, although the water is more of a deterrent to keeping it from burning. But uh, we've heated it up to, I was going to take it to about 275. We ended up at about 240, somewhere around there by the time we got the side bent. And uh, we bent it and I reheated it. And here we are, we're, we're back. So now it is time to undo this. and see just how we made out and we'll also need our form which we will have right here Okay, we got the spring clamps off. And we'll set this in here, and then what we'll end up doing is putting some clamps around. I'll put some spring clamps around it. I've got a plug here, which I had to undo. I don't like to do this too quick because I don't want it to spring on me. I want it to maintain its shape as best I can. Yeah, that's looking good. That's looking good. Now here we go. Remember I told you that the natural tendency of this is when it's like this is to come back up and take the bend out of it, but that's why we reheated it. Okay, I'm going to take this off. This will make it a little easier to get out of here. I will take the... Oh, that's looking... Oh, 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 baby. That is looking good. this again. Well, it's going to need some work on that little machine. You know what? I think we might as well pretend that this is Christmas. Sometimes I try to do stupid things like save every little piece of paper and wax paper and reuse it. It's just not worth the bother. Oh, oh you should smell this. This is almost... Well, friends, there we have it. There's our our bent shape. There's no scorch marks. There's nothing. It's absolutely stunningly perfect. All right. Now, it's not going to fit in the form. This is what we want to do to that bell, right? When you subscribe and you hit the bell to get notified, we want to crunch that sucker into a little ball and fire it out. That's what we need to do. All right. Wow, Hoo -hoo. that is so amazingly good. Oh, I, I am really pumped about this.
pushing this down here like that, that's all. Because this is the top side, the armrest is gonna go in here. And you'll see how we do that not too far off. A few more videos and we'll get to that. It's flat down on the workbench. It's all clamped in and around here. And this is to do nothing more than simply hold it in place. And the easy thing for us to do on the next side is when we take this apart where the split is, I can just mark a line and because we know we've got the one side true, I'll use my square, draw it across, and we'll just cut that on the bandsaw and I'll show you how I do that as well. And then we'll do the same thing for the other side and it's all good. And then it's a case of doing some gluing. All right, well, hey, this is it. I'm not going to uh, make this a long one because we've got some other work we have to do and I need to think about whether or not we're gonna do the kerfing on, on these pieces here. These, by the way, bend in the same shape and run around here. But I really think I need to put some kerfing marks through those. But I'm, I might try thinning it down first just a bit to see if that would uh, do the job. But uh, whatever it is, it's, it's going to be done and it's going to be done right. So at this point, this is nothing to do here, but just leave this. I will mark the, the sides later. I will cut it. It doesn't look like we're gonna need much to do on the uh, small machine here, this, this small bending iron here, because this thing is fitting in totally and tight right in and around the whole shape of the uh, mold that we've got here. So that's, that's it. So honestly, <laughs> I hope you subscribe because you know that subscribers live longer, right? They have better vacations and they're happier people. What can I say? So by all means, please subscribe and then give that, give that notification bell, that little ding a ling a ling -a Just gently sneak up on that thing. Don't let it know you're coming and keep behind your back a great big hammer and then pull out this three pound hammer and hit that sucker and you'll be notified of the next video. So that's about it for this episode. Stay tuned. We've got a whole lot more coming. I will bend the other side and I will do it a little different than what we did here. I was going to do it using this machine and bend it in here, but this worked out so well. I, I, we shouldn't mess with, with City Hall. It works perfect. Let's not get into trouble. All right. So that's it. Time for some English breakfast. You know what? English breakfast is good as a breakfast tea. It's superb as a lunch tea. It's outstanding as a dinner tea. And you can have it any time of day you want because it's amazing. Come on, guys. Get on board. Go with the old English breakfast tea. You'll be happy you did. Oh, that was for the road. I've got to go. Time for a haircut. See y'all later. Bye for now.